I know. Terrible thing. Terrible thing. Where the hell have you been? <laughs> I've had no sleep tonight. Please don't cheat. It's freezing in here. No sleep last night. No sleep. <clears throat> hey now, hi Sesame. Dirty Jersey and Sesame. Um, oh, some some kind soul got me some pizza tonight. I got my oven off, but I'm in the living room tonight. Could you hear me? Can you hear me? I hear you. There's more. I had no sleep. I had no sleep. Yo, 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 sick. Uh, Sesame, these are the, the boots. They fit. Look at the news. You guys want to look at the news? Boots are made Look at the weather. Hold on, I gotta get a cigarette. This is a real donkey show. Yeah, man, I 
this project in Brooklyn. The DA now says he is taking the case to the grand jury. This news on the same night as the wake for 28-year-old Akad Gurley, hit by a ricocheting bullet, fired by a New York cop patrolling a darkened stairwell. I was with reporter Darla Miles at the wake in the Clinton Hill session. Darla. Well, there has been a slight delay in the beginning of the wake. It is yet to begin in just a few minutes. And there are people lined up outside waiting to go inside of Brown Memorial Baptist Church here in Clinton Hill. Now, as you mentioned, the grand jury is, has been announced it will be convened today. And because of the protests in the Eric Garner case, there's a very large police presence outside. The street is blocked off. There are lots of barricades. And they apparently don't want any disruptions, but neither does this family. Let us enjoy the good times we had with him. I mean, so rest in peace. A family begging for peace, not protest. At the time, set aside to honor their son, a tiger early. We want to make sure that people are re reacting to this civilly and peacefully. The family has called for that. A grand jury is being convened to investigate the actions of Officer Peter Liang after he accidentally shot the 28-year-old father in a dark stairwell in East New York two weeks ago. The Daily just reported today that six and a half minutes went by between the time that Akai Gurley was shot and actually any kind of communication between the two officers. Uh, he was going back home with my granddaughter to visit me for the first time in two years. And now um, I never got the opportunity to spend any time with my son and my granddaughter. Oh, I of the public outrage over the grand jury decisions in the Eric Garner and Mike Brown cases, former federal prosecutor and current Brooklyn District Attorney Ken Thompson says, as to those who have called for a special prosecutor to handle this case, I respectfully disagree. It's a case with many questions haunting this family as they prepare for his homegoing celebration. I'm going to say enjoy because I'm going to think about the memories of my son and at the tragic part of my son. And the funeral for Akai Gurley will be right here tomorrow morning at 11 a.m. Reporting live in Clinton Hill, Dara Lamont, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Darla, thank you. Now, the latest in the Eric Garner case in tonight, the NYPD says protests the past two nights have forced crucial resources to be diverted from fighting crimes to dealing with demonstrators. Several huge protests last night, thousands in the street. The numbers, 223 people were arrested, three of them for felonies. And look at this map put together by Twitter on conversations around the world under the hashtag Black Lives Matter, hands up, don't shoot, and I can't breathe. We're going to begin our coverage tonight with Ivan's reporter Josh Einier. He is in Columbus Circle. Josh. And Bill, I want to show you, just before the crowds of people block our view, you see a whole long line of police scooters followed by a lot of police vehicles here. This is sort of the northernmost edge of Columbus Circle where, uh, where Central Park West uh, dead ends here at Columbus Circle. Over there, you see more police vehicles. And then across the way, over to the left, that's the Time Order Center. And we can show you video that we shot about a half hour ago as police were mobilizing there and getting ready uh, for whatever might happen here in Columbus Circle. A protest and other rallies scheduled, according to social media, for 6 o'clock tonight. And it's one of three that we know of here, one in Union Square, and then another down on Wall Street that authorities right now are are getting ready for, although one organizer told Eyewitness News that many of the people who are involved in these protests, frankly, are still in jail from last night, and so this, all of these protests may be a bit delayed at getting up and running. Still, Police Commissioner Bratton says they are as ready as they can be. These demonstrations uh, are drained uh, on the rest of the city. Groups are moving continuously. Uh, there is no leadership that we can identify. There seems to be almost spontaneous leadership, whoever happens to be at the front of the crowd. And uh, that movement is problematic and is causing us to significantly adjust some of the tactics that we use. 223 people arrested last night citywide. It is unclear where these protests will end up and how they will end up, but we will follow them throughout the night. The very latest on Twitter and on Eyewitness News at 11. We're now we're live in Columbus Circle tonight. Josh Anchor, Channel 7, Eyewitness News. Josh, thank you. From Columbus Circle, we head to Wall Street, where Jim Dolan is there, and a few dozen protesters starting to demonstrate there. Jim. Yeah, but much more than last night, the smaller probably than we'll gather in Columbus Circle tonight, but a couple of dozen, maybe 30 protesters gathered here on the steps here on Wall Street, probably outnumbered by the number of media here to cover them. So far, no sign of much NYPD force. There is the usual uh, park police that are here uh, to monitor the situation. That so far has been sufficient. Uh, again, the police have not shown up in large numbers here. And about 30 protesters have, and a light rain, which probably will keep the numbers down. 
involved with a rear view camera and had to recommend that. Wolfgang, why are you on the table?
Slice of New York pizza.
but then getting lighter tomorrow morning before we get poured on tomorrow afternoon after about 2 in the afternoon. Radar's filled in. It's raining lightly on Long Island. A little steadier over Brooklyn, parts of southern Nassau. Not much Monmouth and Ocean. And then we look at Central New Jersey where it's raining steadily. And then here's the icing over parts of Sussex County right now. As you can see right here, as you move toward Hamburg on Route 23. And then as we head up into the Catskills, a little snow right here. That was near Liberty. A little area of snow and some sleet and freezing rain here. So some icy travel along I-84, Route 17 and 52. Those are the trouble spots. And this is just with patchy lighter precipitation. Now, this is coming in heavier through the evening hours, so I think the next several hours will be pretty dicey here across northwest New Jersey and into the Catskills and Mid-Hudson Valley, so try to reduce your travel if you can. So, a steady period of rain for about 3 to 5 in the morning, a lull in the rainfall, and then this is the soaking rain, and the heaviest part of the storm, which starts tomorrow afternoon and goes through tomorrow night, maybe 10 to midnight. So the icing, until we get to Iowa Susan 11, where I think temperatures are now rising and the precipitation starts to get lighter after midnight, there is your morning lull. I mean, it's not that the rain will totally shut off, but it becomes intermittent and light, and then here it goes again, a resurgence after 1 or 2 in the afternoon, really heavy at night, maybe even ends with some snow north and west, no accumulation, maybe a coating in the high spots. And then it's blustery and cold on Sunday, and it feels like we're in the 30s again. So a steady rain coming in now. Icy traffic
Fucking shit. Check my pizza. Oh. I'm a little blue. I don't know what's good. I had a dessert on a guest pack that you can fucking call.
Yeah. 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 Yeah, Sesame will be here in July. We'll be here in July on this couch. Nope. In July. July, he will be here. Sesame, did you get to dinner for yourself? do good with the pizza hut tonight. I'm going to do the pizza hut too. Thank you. 
Open Pizza. Why did I eat? What what it was what the, the hell is dirty jersey? Ha 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 I don't know. And now he just woke up. So um dirty jersey you're actually more by Pennsylvania that you can't see the channel seven eyewitness news.
A big report out tonight. Local news from New Jersey Governor Chris Christie eyeing a possible run for the White House. The report about the controversial closing of the George Washington Bridge in January. What? No conclusive evidence that Christie was aware of the plan blamed on. I'll see you during the day. Any eye-opening number tonight on American jobs. 321,000 new jobs created in November, the most in nearly three years. Unemployment now steady at 5.8 percent. But let's get right to ABC's chief business correspondent, Rebecca Jarvis. Yes, indeed, ABC's Jersey. No, tell us what's going on in Jersey. I had no sleep. Two slices of pizza out of my stomach owns.
Raining until tomorrow. It's going to rain and rain. Where are you? Yeah, we're going to get heavy rain. Heavy rain. I got to put my cup over. Heavy rain all the way long. My chest is cooking. Do you imagine I even turn guest chat on and that they don't even talk? What's with my channel that nobody likes to talk to my channel? What the fuck? Even if I turn guest chat on, nobody comes on me. And all my outlaw on this fucking site. I even turned guest chat on and nobody talks. Oh, you, oh you're insulting sesame chicken? He's a marine. He will kick your ass. All right, uh, sesame chicken. Somebody just called you a ch sissy chicken. What? Yeah, donkeys. Oh, God. Hey, we have no music on the show tonight. We have no Martha, my dear. You like these boots? Sesame chicken bought them for them. Hi, James. How are you? Am I a pirate? Yes, I am. Now I'm going to put the boots on him. He's not going to put the boots on me. I'll put the boots on him. Does it work? Uh, 
Right now. <laughs> hey, Sesame, I had no sleep last night. No freaking sleep. I don't know what I'm doing. I'm innocent. I'm innocent. I'm innocent. I have no. Uh, I really am innocent. Um. Let's see what you can send me. So this is the living room. Do you like the living room? Does everybody like the living room? Do you like how I decorate? Do you like how I decorate my house? Oh. Uh, No, sesame chicken is not ugly at all. Yes, the couch is, uh, sesame chicken um, is very handsome. Oh, uh, he's a really good looking guy. Hey, uh, what can I tell you? Hey. Uh, uh, yes, forever young. Um, with more stuff. Well, what I would like to do is on one of my walls, I would like to get that fake brick shit going on, like in my last apartment. Um, I don't have that fake br uh, the brick shit. Uh, wow, somebody's jealous of sesame chick. Oh, oh no. How rude can you be? But sesame chicken is marine and he will fend for himself. I will not have to fight his battles, which is a good thing. Um, uh, I love when people fight their own battles because, you know, it's really not my fault if somebody doesn't like somebody else. It's not my fucking problem. Fend for yourselves and fire arms. Um, you know, fire arms and protect yourself. That's what the world is about. I can't protect you. I can't protect me. I can't protect anybody. Yeah. Uh, no, this is just, um, I had no sleep. And uh, personally, the show is dedicated to Sesame Chicken because uh, I haven't done a show with him on it in a long time. And that is why I came on here with no goddamn friggin' sleep. And, um, it's all in honor of Sesame Chick. And I love Sesame Chick. I work out. I work out. 
Let's hear a song that, um, is that that? I will attempt. Um, I didn't climb my stairs today. I usually climb stairs rather than do that today. That's true. We have no more music on on this show. Everybody, there's no music. Unless, um, hello, guests. Uh, why is it that the guest people don't sign the fuck in? That's why I turned guest chat on today. I want to know why nobody signs into my channel. Are you getting bullied by people? If you go to Miss Luna's channel, you will get your ass kicked. Um, because that's what's going on. Because we are shy. Bullshit. Bullshit. We ain't shy. You're nice, but you won't sign in. So if you're so nice, Mr. Three four three three two 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 nine six four. Um, why won't you? All right, so you're Mr. Keeper. Boy. So come back with your name. Prove yourself. I'm always. But why are you afraid to? Give me ratings. You know, you're ruining my ratings by not signing in. Do you know that? You're ruining my fucking career. Alright? So all you guessed, you are ruining my fucking career by not signing in. Yes. So, you know, if I had to turn on guest chat to make that SOS statement, you guys are ruining my career. Well, we all know that you ain't a winner in that guest six, seven, one, six, seven, uh, two, three, three, one, six, five. Sitting on my ass career, really? You really think that I have sat on my... First of all, I'm not even... I'm lying down on my stomach. So I ain't sitting on my ass, mister. You don't see me sitting on my ass. Jealousy, Mr. Tomato Head. I sense a thing of jealousy of an older woman. Oh God, please help you. Jealousy is right. Why are you jealous of me? You're too late. Oh, keep her boy. All right, keep her boy was a man. He did sign in. Um, yeah, keep it quiet. Yeah. So, are you friends with Mr. Taylor, or you're not friends with him? I don't really know what's going on. What's going on? What's going on? I don't lock in. This is as good as it gets. This show is as good as it's getting because I am freaking tired. You know, Frank's friend, okay. I love these boots. 
that pizza is going to put you to sleep. I have a cramp right now going on in my left leg. It's beginning. The cramp is beginning. My life isn't grand as though you think it is. Oh. All right, Black Keeper Boy, tell Frank that I said hello. Please tell him Miss Luna and Wolfgang say hello. Thank you very much. All right. Oh. Uh, Sesame Chicken, it seems like 6716322. is uh, my lover. Okay. All right. Yes. Yes. 6716322. Let's let the cat out of the goddamn bag. Yes, you are my lover. Okay. Yes. Whoa! So you know what the light is in here. Oh. Okay. Oh. Uh. Whoa! Yes, I'm a lesbian. I don't want sesame chicken. Correct. Correct. That is correct. Thank you, guest. 67163223165 for pointing that out to sesame chicken. Thank you very much. You did me a big favor. I appreciate it. Thank you very, very much. Hey, Wolf, what do you think? Is that a good idea? Yeah. Oh, there you go. I love you, Wolf. I love you. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. You're a nice boy. You're a good boy. You're a good boy. You're a good boy,
because of me chicken did your icon It's um, a documentary. This is just what I'm doing at the moment. the phone. Right, yeah. Oh. Well, good luck. Yeah, and 
and then I, yeah, that's it. So I succeed. So I got another lot. I got four slides. It is. Yep. Yep. So that's it. Nothing else. Yeah. So I gotta wait until Grandma comes home. So I'm doing that. I had no sleep last night at all, and I really need sleep. But it's gonna rain all day tomorrow. So. Uh, Uh, all right, well, don't start t talking to me about this shit. I mean, I, I don't want to talk about tomorrow morning. I'm gonna, I got things to do. It's going to be winter freezing, uh, rain. It's going to be really bad. Why? Who said that I'm, go I'm going out tomorrow? Who said that? Yeah, well, I do, but I don't, I don't know. All right, sweetheart, I love you. So how is life treating you all? How are you doing in your land of life? Are you doing good in life? Are you happy in life? What is going on with you in life? Hello. What is going on? What is your story? Everybody seems to know my story. What the hell is your story? All right. Uh, sesame chicken. So far, so good. Okay, there's the story. Sesame chicken, what are you eating? Are you eating? Did you eat? Are you hungry yet? I'm eating barbecue. So is Hawaii's good for you. I don't even know what f fiber cubes are. Nor do I want to know. I have no interest in that shit. Fiber cubes. Nothing yet. Not really hungry, huh? Um, thank you, guest six seven one six three two two three one six five. Thank you, guest. Um, but really, like the guests, everybody here, I'm doing tonight's show with guest chat on. It's going off after tonight. Um, you guys are hurting my ratings and my showbiz act. Please sign in and speak. Even if you have to make a fake name up, um, even if you have to make a fake name up, please just sign in so I get ratings. I have tonight off here, Miss Luna. I work all night, six nights on one night and one night. You and Sesame Chicken should get along well. Right, Sesame Chicken? Um, Sid, every time I use my toaster, I think of you. Every time I push that goddamn button down, I think of you. Um, yeah, you men are constantly workaholics. Hi, Chris, whoever you are. Well, it's exactly not Niagara Falls. Just say it.
High five. High five. Good boy. High five. High five. Come on. High five. High five. High five. High five. Oh. Your hair is all messed up. Your hair is all messed up. Your hair is all messed up. We'll play the production. Your hair is so messed up. Really? Oh. I am giving him static. Honey, don't show me like that. It's kind of sexual. It is. I love it. Oh, yeah, no, don't show my back, honey, please. Oh, no, my foot fetish is coming out. Oh, no. Now everybody's going to talk about your foot fetish on the internet. Why did you have to go do that? show as unpopular as it is. Why'd you have to tell everybody about your goddamn foot fetish? Oh, you leave now. I don't think that, I don't think that Wolfgang would like that this me. A mohawk? No, he ain't gonna get a mohawk. I hope. Look at how cute he is. Yeah, I know. My daughter just got her dog a haircut. 
But he never got his hair cut all his life. No hair cut. I hope this was a good way for you to wake up, Sesame Chicken. I know that you just woke up. Um, am I considering a haircut, Luna? What do you think the answer? Oh, for Wolfgang. Um, no, if I won't get a haircut, he can't get one. I know he would look adorable. Yes. Uh, yes, Theodore has. Theodore, yeah. Theodore, of course, gets that special treatment. But... Theodore and Wolfgang are like those people in Modern Family. You watch that show? Um, does anybody watch Modern Family here? Anybody? Uh, there's the um, fat guy and the they're both gay guys. Uh, well, Wolfgang is like the fat gay guy, and Theodore is like the skinny blonde guy. Do you... <laughs> Wouldn't you like to know? You got $10,000? I will answer that question. Guess 671 632 23165. I will answer that question. For $10,000. No problem. Okay. So, um, alright. So, there you have. Um, alright. Um, Mr. Chris, I would say that you are from the, uh, the guy from Chris from, uh, Florida. Because his name was, uh, Chris. No. Alright, maybe you're that guy, the other guy who used to that bought me the thing for my stove. That guy, what was his name? Uh, Dirty Jersey's friend. I forgot what his name is. Uh, what the hell? Joe. Maybe you're Joe. I have no idea. Right. Why don't you just come out and address who the hell you are? What is the big mystery? Why, why can't you say who the hell you are? over here in front of a goddamn fucking camera and you can't say who the hell you are. Uh, the dishwasher. What dishwasher? Oh, no. I do all the time. Now, he ain't eat the dishwasher, dirty jerks. No, I ain't eat the dishwasher. Uh, I'm sad. You know. I know Martha who it is. Uh. Oh, Sesame is trolling me. You think so? Do you think, should I stop talking to Sesame Chicken? You think I should? Maybe I should just stop talking to him. What do you think? He's just trolling me, right? Uh. Yeah, dirty Jersey's trying to figure it out. <laughs> Says the chicken is nodding his head no. Dirty Jersey, no, no, no. Well, we were just trying to have some fun with guests. Six seven one six three two two three one six five. Oh. All right, so um, I don't know about you all, but um, we're going to be getting rain in New York tomorrow. Holla, holla, hi. Hi, Mr. L. Bob So. How are you, Mr. L. Bob So? Um, it's Chris from New Upstate New York. I don't know any Chris in Upstate New York. I don't know Chris in upstate New York. I just don't want to see you hurt, Luna. 
so so. Sesame could be a scumbag, a creepy pervert. Oh, Sesame Chicken, are you a scumbag and a creepy pervert? Um, are you Sesame Chicken, or are you a scumbag and very creepy pervert? Um, I was the only one in your room back in the day. Uh, I don't, but I don't know anybody. Maybe upstate. All right, then you're a woman. Are you a woman, Chris? Um, all right. All right, so, all right, so Sesame Chicken admits that he is a scumbag, heck a creepy, and a pervert. Oh, well. Okay, I still love him. All right. Oh, it's all right, Sesame. Uh, I don't know who you are, Mr. Chris. I don't know anybody from upstate New York. I don't know anybody. I'll do, the only one I know from upstate New York is Sarah, six foot two. That's the only one I know, which I haven't seen. Has anybody seen Sarah lately? Where the hell is she? I like Sarah. Oh, uh, I don't know where she is. Um, I'll just tell the donkeys what they want to hear. It doesn't matter what I say. No being Wayne. I have no idea what that... Does anybody know what that word means? No be we know. I have no idea what that word means. Remember when you were having trouble with your internet bad in the day? Oh, good. Well, I was always having trouble uh, with my internet, actually. Uh, um, I got to take a wicked piss, though. Does anybody have to go to the bathroom? Um, anybody, write down one if you have to go take a piss. Um, if you don't have to take a piss, all right, all right, um, whoever has to take a wicked piss, please, like, write number one. All right, so apparently, all right, wait, minus one? What does minus one mean? Like, real bad? Oh, God, Dirty Jersey has to do number two. You could figure what shit comes out of somebody from... There, there would be nobody in the world that would say number two, but uh, somebody from New Jersey. Um, I mean, really. I mean, how humiliating can you get? Uh, oh, my God, please. God, have mercy on Dirty Jersey, please. Somebody pray for him. All right, I got to pray for this guy. I don't even know every goddamn night. Because he doesn't have the sense of a New Yorker. I mean, we're asking questions. Who has to take a wicked piss? Please write down number one. And he writes number two. Like, too much information here. All right. Um, uh, no, not that guy. Martha, he's not from upstate. No, that guy's not from upstate. No. Nope. That slipped. I'm sure that your shit slipped out of your fucking ass, Jersey. I hope you were on a toilet bowl. And I hope Lana wasn't sitting on your toilet seat. But, yeah. My family is downstairs and I told them I can't come down because Luna is on. Oh my. These boots are made for walking, and that's just what they'll do. One of these days, these boots are gonna walk all over me. I like these boots. I do. I like these boots a lot. Oh, Um. 671 sign in. Why? What happened to 671? What did I miss? Uh, uh, 671. Sesame, you better treat Luna good. So, oh, we know who 671 is. That's, um, the chick from England. She from England? What's her name? Oh, yeah, Sherry Breeze. Um, all right. 
Good evening, Luna. How are you, Rider 176? What is popping tonight in your life? <laughs> Hold on a minute. I'll be right back. I gotta get some water. my chest. Thank you. 
second rider was 76. So how is everybody doing? What is life today? What is going on with you all? I had no sleep last night. I don't feel good. But, um, I came on here just to say, uh, cause I especially came on for sesame chicken, uh, cause it's his night off, and I wanted to do a show for sesame chicken, and, um, uh, that's just what I did. And, uh, we haven't had any music on here at all, cause, um, I'm not in my kitchen, so, uh, I'm in my bed, bed. Uh, what kept me awake? It, I have no idea. Um, I went to bed last night at, um, I was doing an art project. Okay. I was doing an art project. And, um, hi, Acoustic, how are you? Um, I was doing an art project and, um, it was really intense. All right. Um. Well, but there's no way that I'm going to go to sleep at, what time is it, 7.38? If I go to sleep at 7.38, I'll wake up at 2 o'clock in the morning, wide awake. And then I'm going to get into the same battlefield all over again. Um, oh. True. Uh, so I figured I'd hang out and, you know, uh, we were on the phone for so many hours last night, but I didn't do a show that you couldn't see me, so I figured I'd come on here. You wouldn't stop me, though, laugh out loud. I really got to get back into my book, everybody. Um, it really is my priority. I really got to stop doing what I'm doing. What I'm doing is not correct. Um, this is all not correct, what I'm doing. Oh, I'm not doing the correct thing. I need to forget about this show, what I do. I need to forget about this. And I need to just put all my brains and effort into finishing my book. Oh. What makes you think we didn't already have sex? They're donkeys. They're donkeys. Um, all right. Um, let's get up to um, the next topic of the show, which is slang. All right. So slang. We are all going to do um, something here. Slang. Everybody give me the slang for drinking a sugar drink. I'm not going to say my slang. A sugar drink. Would you please... Um, Everybody write down the slang for a sugar drink. I don't know. You have no idea? Guess 393732214833. All right, Martha, my dear, got soda. All right, she's up on the list. All right, everybody else. Soda. All right. And would you please, after you write the name Martha and guess 393732214833, could you write where you are from? Could you uh, just recopy what you just wrote with the state that you are from? That's part of the test. Um, okay. So, uh, UK, 
No, all right, UK, but you have to, what is a sugar drink? What do you call it in the UK? We need to know. Uh, all right, Michigan, yes, we know where you, we want you not, we want you to write what is the sugar drink with where you are. Do you understand? Do you understand? Write the sugar drink name and then where you're from on there. It's a simple exercise, everybody. Very simple. Okay, there you go. Sesame chip. Uh, all right. Um, all right. Uh, but how Sesame Chicken did it was the right way. You know, just say the name and the town. No, no explanations. You don't live there anymore or nothing like that. Uh, just uh, towns. Do we have an, uh, that many people uh, that would participate in the survey? Camp P. What, Marine, uh, what are you saying, Camp P? What the hell is Camp P? I don't know. Uh, Pendleton. All right. Um, UK calls it a soft drink. All right. Um, Sesame Chicken calls it pop. And Ryder calls it pop. And I don't know who Ryder is, but uh, Sesame Chicken's in Michigan. Martha calls it soda, and I believe Dirty Jersey must have said soda, too. Uh, all right. Well, everybody, get your vocabulary twisted out of your brain, and remember this. For a sugar drink, it's called soda. S-O-D-A. So wherever you are, please do the challenge and start calling it soda and see if people notice you. And what their reaction to you is that you are calling it soda. Okay, so um, I would like really appreciate to do this experiment. If uh, wherever you are from, if whatever it is, if it's called pop, say, I want a soda. And when they don't understand you, just stomp your goddamn fucking feet and say, I want a goddamn soda until they get the message through. And um, that's really all that I would like that. Um, I hope that um, by next week we could find the answer. So everybody got a week, a week. You all got a week. We'll do it on Friday night to find out what the, everybody's reaction was. Right. Uh, all Um, I got these boots as gift from Sesame. And um, I got them yesterday in the mail. And I am so happy. They fit me like a glove. They fit me like blue. Oh. Uh, why? What happened? Why did uh, Chris get uh, muted? Why? Why did acoustic uh, purge, Mr. Chris? What's going on here? All right, well, um, all right, uh, where the hell is acoustic? Okay, hold on, let me go over here. Uh, okay, no, 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 no.
All right. Okay. I have to do what I have to do. Now acoustic comes back. Acoustic, why did you me um all right, Sesame? Um, why did you um uh, get rid of um uh, Chris? What did he say wrong? Now why are you doing the American flag? Because of my stores. Okay. Accident, man. It was an accident. All right. All right. Let me put you back as a mod. All right. I'll go. Uh, Chris. No, no, serious, Sam, you asshole. Like, I don't know who the freak you are. Get the hell out of here. Don't let the door hit you on the way out, Mazika. You are a toxic human fucking being. Well, fuck yourself up your ass. Did I? We got. We just got rid of the trash. We took the trash out into the garbage. Anyway, so this is like way. Um, this is more comfortable than sitting in my kitchen after I had no sleep, no sleep at all. Shit. A woman my age needs beauty sleep. Why did he get why why are you playing games? I or orc a day. How are you, Ark a day? How are you? Hi, Mr. Guest four five seven zero three two three zero two six nine six.
I secure? How are you? How are you, secure? Uh, a round of applause for the good artwork that Secure did on the banner, on the front page, and on uh, the purple. I love the purple. It's great. Oh, check that. Oh, the purple is really great. It really is. Secure, I look at my new boots. Girls, any women in here? Any women? Any women in here? I see. I'll secure, I look at my boots. Why would they be sweaty? I wear these in the summertime. Okay. Um, so the topic of the show is um the um the reason why guest is on all right the reason why guest is on is because you're ruining my freaking career all right by me not getting ratings by you not signing in you're damaging me so that's why i have issued an alert for the guests that this is the last time the guest chat is going to be on in a very long time so, um, really? Oh, okay. Is your mom okay? I won't get any viewers if I turn guest chat off. Why is that guest seven five four five three two three one three nine four? Yeah, what about guests? Because you're ruining my reputation. That's funny, says me because my sister just called. How funny. Yeah, I know, but if with that with them not signing in, it's making my viewer count small.
What does getting view do? What does getting to number one really mean? It means something to an Italian in New York City. Oh, it does. I want to be number one. It's my challenge. Only means something if you are an attention whore. That person got banned. I didn't even do it. So, oh, I have a battery after. Um, so, um, I just do a documentary. That's basically it. I do a, uh, maybe I do do a boring show. It could be that, I, but I don't think that it's boring. I don't think that my show is boring. Oh. Shows open. Thank you very much, Marie. All right, um, I think it's time to uh, get rid of guest chat. I think it's time to say bye bye to guest chat. Okay. Uh, well, if you want to talk, just come on in, all right? You got to just sign in, and you could talk all you want. Um, you're not going to get banned for something silly. So, um, all right, so guests, please sign in. Miles Lizards. All right, guest chat is off. All right, so, um, if they want to talk, um, I'd love to have them talk to me, but just sign in, make up a different name that none of your friends know, so you don't have to get bullied, and, um, everybody could be happy, I could be happy, you could be happy, and we could talk. Um, right. Thank you, Maureen, you were really good. Um, I figured I would turn that crap off, because, um... The message was said. Uh, there was no more need to say any more. Uh, guess by not uh, signing in, you're making me not get to number one where I should be. And, um, you know, that's basically it. So, um, all right, so it's 8 o'clock at night. Um, um, no dinner tonight, or did I miss it? You missed it. I had pizza. Pizza. 
Sheet. Sheet, repeat. Are you having any any protests in uh, Indiana for all this cop um, shootings? That the cops are shooting everybody. There's protests going on here nonstop. All right. Um, I love the banner. It's beautiful. I love the um, the thing, uh, the other banner that goes across showing the different TV shows. I love it. I love that. Um, so um, I appreciate it very much, Secure. Everybody, do you know Secure's uh, icon? Please post it in the channel now. Uh, as I will look. Uh, All right, me too. Thank you, Maureen. I'm going to be getting off too. Um, that's a curious icon. The pigeon. Night, night, Maureen. God bless. I salute you. Yeah, so um, tomorrow, I don't know wherever you all are going to be, but in New York City, it is going to be pouring out. The rain is raining now. Um, not that heavy as far as I could hear, but um, it's going to be starting to rain, drizzle, and tomorrow is going to be an outpour of a Saturday that um, uh, Dirty Jersey is looking for some pizza. He's on the hunt down looking for pizza pie. Well, just, um, just all he has to do is go over the George Washington Bridge. and But uh, apparently he's in southern Jersey, which must be closer to um, Pennsylvania. So I think he's more by Frank Taylor. So you could go to Frank Taylor's show. You could go to his house and be on his show, Dirty Jersey. You're too far from where I am. Uh, secure. I had no sleep last night. I feel very tired. Uh, so I decided to do a show that I could lounge around instead of being in the kitchen. Yes, you're right, Dirty Jersey. Yeah, you know, I like to change it around. I was in my living room and now we're in the bedroom. And, um, yeah, nothing really is going on. I'm, I'm tired as hell. Um, I was on the other night, and there was, like, a, a batch of different type of people that I never seen in my life. And, um, you know, I was on there for a while, but, um, I haven't seen the regular like you guys. I've been on the last few nights, and there's been nobody there. I guess we, uh, I, I came on here, uh, no, not yesterday, the day before yesterday, I think. Frank lives further from me than you are. He does? Frank Taylor did wonders with that house of his. Well, he did good. There were guests coming in surf rap room saying that Luna made a thousand dollars panhandling. Lavis said, "So I figured you were you were out in the street." Wow, where's the thousand dollars? I didn't get a thousand dollars panhandling. I wish. Nope. If I had it, shit, I didn't get the thousand dollars. Nope. Nope. It's a lie. It's a lie. It's nothing but a lie. 
Basically, that's it. I really have, I have a lot to say, but I'm really tired. I really am tired. I should not have come to my bed. Did I do all night? Twist and turn. I don't think anybody's talking anymore. I don't think the sun is out. I don't know. 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 I
show though. Uh, there's nobody talking. It serves no purpose. Well, uh, maybe something happens in the chat. Nobody's talking, so I'm going off camera. How do you like that? Uh, I'm going off camera. Um, I did my show for Friday, December 5th, 2014. Uh, God bless you, everybody. I don't know where the hell you all went. Uh, but you must all be taking a look at kisses or some bullshit. Um, I don't know where you are. And uh, maybe something happens to chat. Oh, this is me. Uh, yes. Oh, oh, in other words, yeah, get off the air. We want to go. So obvious, you know. Uh, all right. All right. Yes. Good night, everybody. So obvious. They wanted us off the freaking air, the assholes. They wanted us off the air. Oh, we're still on camera. All right. I love you all. You're a jackass.